Hey everyone, this is Brian at F Studios. I just got done with the keyboard pieces to the track. It only spent, well, I only spent maybe four hours, maybe three hours messing around with shit, trying to get the keyboard program to sound the way I like it before actually putting it down on the rec recording. And then I did some preliminary mixing. It's pretty much done, except I just got to bring in the guitars now uh, for a a lead track and a section where there's just a bit of an accent track. Get those mixed in, then I can really fine tune everything. Might have to do a little bit of editing because editing, when there were some parts I was recording, it sounded like I was on time while I was recording them, but now when I'm listening back, the way they blend in with everything else that's going on, there's certain spots where it just doesn't sit right with me. I mean, if you listen to them on the click, they work fine. If you listen to them with just a couple tracks here and there, they work fine. But when you start blending them in with everything, it there's spots where it's just like, okay, that came in a little early. Even when you measure it out, it's only like a couple of milliseconds. But to me, I hear it. That bugs me. And the same way with like when I was working on, working on vocal tracks last night, um, I recorded the vocals and... Things sounded okay recording them, but then listening back, it just never sat right. So I ran the vocals, uh, the harmony part pieces, through uh, an auto-tune just to try and get it done really quick. And it made it a little bit better, but it still didn't sound quite right. And then when I put the keyboards in, I noticed, well, shit, the tuning of the instruments that I put down before is about 2% higher in pitch than what uh, the keyboard is set at, which should be perfect uh, standard tuned pitch because I haven't changed any of that on the keyboard. So I took a high quality uh, pitch shift processor and stuck it on the vocal tracks and manipulated it a bit and found out the tracks were 19 cents flat. Okay, well, that's on me because when we were doing the vocal tracks and I just wasn't singing to a plain track. The tracks are heavily coursed. So I was off. Nothing to be said about it. No excuses, no nothing. So I went in there and did a little bit of editing to increase the pitch of the tracks by 19 cents. And everything came out sounding spot on now. It's all right where it needs to be. So I need to do something similar with the tracks that are out of time. Just fine tune them a little bit by... Uh, moving uh, the areas where the initial attack of the instrument comes in just ever so slightly and then that'll make me happy now if it was already well if it was still like working on the actual instruments together like last night I could just re-record the part and be over and done with but since it's the next night and everything's been changed around a bit it's just faster to use a little editing there so that's what I'll be doing uh, now I think I'm going to just sit down, relax a little bit, relax my ears, and uh, I think I'll check out the second episode of Haunting of Hill House. Anyway, you guys take it easy. We'll talk to you later. Hopefully I'll have this track ready for everybody to listen to here pretty soon. Have a good night.